channel if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell as well i do drop new content on this channel every single day so with that being said let's get right into this video today monday march 15th after hours and i want to talk about two specific stocks that i definitely think you guys need to have on your watch list if they are not on there already first stock being zometica ticker symbol zom all right this stock has been going crazy up to two dollars and fifty cents at the time of this video volume has been crazy as well 178 million trades of zometica on average per day and if we take a look at the chart here you can see zometica has been on a consistent climb over the last six months right so around mid-february early to mid-february this stock cleared three dollars has since fallen off a little bit but we are slowly starting to see this build back up and over the last three months has been consistently above two dollars so it's beautiful beautiful to see and let's just talk specifically about why i like zometica so if you don't know about zometica you guys they are a health animal health company animal health diagnostic company and they really have something pretty cool in true forma now if you don't know specifically pet spending and people spending money on their pets is at an all-time high you guys people love to spend money on their pets so this is a very very lucrative niche and a niche that i believe is going to be around forever so pet diagnostics is a very important uh, aspect of pet health so zometica is an Amer animal health company focused on meeting in the needs of clinical veterinarians in ways to promote both patient and practice health their mission is to advance the effectiveness and financial well-being of veterinary practi practitioners by delivering professionally beneficial diagnostic products and services, and that professional diagnostic service is Truforma. So what Truforma does is they take away the middleman of lab tests and diagnosing these pets when they come into the vet office. And Zometica, you guys, they use these assays, immunoassays that they read, and they're able to test and see what is specifically wrong with the pet and give an analysis that veterinarians normally have to send to a lab and wait days to receive the results and this essentially makes and or allows like you can see here veterinaries veterinarians to make clinical decisions faster and begin treating patients sooner so absolutely groundbreaking stuff this is a simple device that will be inside the vet office and they're able to get this information treat the pet as soon as possible the right way it's going to help the veterinaries themselves and create more revenue and business. It's going to help the pet owners have a peace of mind and save money and time. And then obviously it's going to help the pet heal from whatever ailment they do have. Now, the timeline for True Forma, you guys, every pretty much every investor that is in True Forma is waiting for March 30th, 2021, where planned sales are set to begin for True Forma. They signed a distribution agreement with Miller Veterinary Supply, which is one of the fast industry, veterinary industry's fastest growing businesses and is now the oldest wholesale veterinary distribution, distributor in the United States. Okay, so this stock has been going up to two. It's already at two dollars fifty cents. You guys, I definitely think we can see five dollars, you guys, on Zometica in the next couple of weeks okay leading up to march 30th and after march 30th who knows where this stock could go but again i definitely see double you could double your money on this stock in my opinion again just my opinion please please do your own research before investing your money but this is definitely a stock you guys that has massive massive potential pet spending all time high i think pet spending is a 90 billion dollar market so people are spending money on their pets like never before and so Medica is right in the heart of all that. And it's tr true forma. It's really a groundbreaking product, you guys. And I really believe Zometica can hit the $5 range. So if you don't already, please, please put Zometica on your watch list and definitely think about trying to enter Zometica at a nice price point, maybe somewhere between $2.30 to $2.60. Even right now, I would say is a nice price entry point. But again, just my personal opinion. This is not financial advice. So let's move on to the next stock that I want to talk about that you need to have on your watch list. Stock that you guys need to have on your watch list that I really, really like and extremely bullish on is Castor Maritime, ticker symbol CTRM. 
Now, this stock is sitting at $1.03 at the time of this video, up about 1% on the day. And you can see the volume has been pretty crazy for CTRM, 192 million trades per day, down today at only 57 million, but nonetheless, very, very heavy volume on this stock. Now, I've been pretty bullish on CTRM in other videos that I've made about this stock, but I wanted to talk about why I am today, specifically for Caster Maritime. So, if you don't know about Caster Maritime, you guys, they are a maritime dry bulk shipping company. And the dry bulk shipping industry as a whole, you guys, is really, really hot right now. Um, the rates for these dry bulk shipping companies in the Baltic Exchange are at an all-time high, I think like a five-week high currently. So the industry that it's in is going to be around, obviously, for a very, very long time. Many lifetimes from now, we will still need to be sh using dry bulk shipping. So Caster Maritime, you guys, is a company that I see growing and growing. And they have been completely just full upward trend in 2021 as far as growing their fleet. And if you just take a look at some of these press releases, okay? For example, let's go back to the beginning of the year. January 20th, Caster Maritime announces a vessel acquisition. Janu February 1st, another vessel acquisition. February 3rd, another vessel acquisition. February 11th, two more vessel ac uh, vessels acquired. February 18th, another vessel acquired. March 3rd, another vessel. March 10th, another vessel. And March 12th, another vessel, you guys. So absolutely incredible stuff caster maritime growing every single week it seems like they're announcing a new vessel and even now you see you can see here the ceo of caster maritime he says we are pleased to announce our eighth vessel acquisition in 2021 with the addition of another carm sarmax dry bulk vessel our fifth to the caster's fleet upon completion of all our recently announced acquisitions our fleet will consist of 14 vessels Right? They've added eight different vessels already in 2021. We're already we're only in March. Okay. They've already added eight. They now have 14 vessels. And that's what they said at the beginning of the year that they were trying to grow their vessels and grow their overall fleet. As you can see, even by their website, they're about us, you guys. You can see here we are a growth oriented global shipping company engaged in the seaborne transportation of a wide range of dry bulk commodities along worldwide shipping routes through our ownership of dry bulk vessels now also something that i find very very interesting in regards to caster maritime is that the biden administration they're pushing clean energy okay clean energy across the world is something that has been a priority for a lot of countries and some a lot of these vessels that caster maritime has are the some of the lowest emitting emissions uh, the lowest emitting vessels in the market and in, in the space. So Caster Maritime is right there, ready to go as far as the clean energy goes as well. And sitting at $1.03, you guys, I think a lot of people were originally hyped on CTRM because of the short squeeze and Reddit investors were pushing CTRM. But now we are seeing consistent price leveling out here around $1. And I really think this has potential to go to $2 in the coming weeks. If you take a look at the three month chart here, Caster Maritime was clearly at $2 back on February 11th, has since dipped off. But again, we are seeing a nice leveling out at around $1. And $2 for Caster Maritime in the coming months is very, very possible. So make sure you guys put this stock in your watch list as well. So Caster Maritime, CTRM, Zometica, ZOM, make sure you guys have them both on your watch list if you not don't have them already. Let me know in the comments below if you guys have any ZOM or CTRM. Let me know what price you guys got in both those stocks at. Hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and as always, you guys have a great day.